How are you getting along with uh, Coach Khan um, so far? How smooth has that trans transition been? Oh, I love him. He's a, he's a competitor. He lets, a, he lets him play. I mean, let's just have a little fun out there let it be ourselves. So I love it. It seems like the defense is kind of ahead of the offense right now. That's what we've been hearing from the coaches. <laughs> I mean, we just come out here and compete with the right mindset. So, I mean, that's what they feed us in the meeting. Room, so we just come out here and compete. <laughs> Just, uh, kind of standing out at that other safety spot. I mean, everybody pretty much done. Of course, we all got mistakes. But I like the way uh, Tanner's playing. Is Isaiah's coming along and Kareem Williams is balling right now. So we all just out there competing for the fun. What's the biggest part of your game that you're working on right now to improve? Uh, just my man coverage. My man coverage is the biggest thing. So I got the tackling down and everything. Like that, but it's working on man coverage. That back group is going to take over that leadership role that, that Jatar had. Yeah, I, I, I think it's a little bit of everybody. Like Ryan Carter, Marcus Edmund, uh, me, Tanner. We all just feed in with each other and just communicate with everybody. So, this is all of us. Would you hear uh, you know, Coach Reed, does he say, expect no drop off? Is he saying, you know, we're going to be better? What's his message to your group? I mean, just come out here and compete. Like I said, really, just everybody out here competing. I mean, it's good job. What are you seeing from Kayvon so far? You think he can take a big step forward this spring? Okay, I'm having a good spring right now. So, I mean, they had him playing safety nickels, now they moving the corner, so he just had to learn everything. And I, I, I applaud him for that because a lot of people can't do that, so I think he'll be all right in the corner. So. All right. That's one of the things that I hadn't been saying a lot as a top ball. I feel like that now that, that, that question is, is it going to come up in the way this defense is going to be close and regroups every year? I mean, yeah, I think so, but of course, there's always somebody that's going to say, oh, they lost these, these guys or they lost them. So, of course, somebody's always going to say it's going to be a drop out. But I think here, we everybody's going to compete. They bring in players to compete. So, I mean, every day your job is in jeopardy. So, you got to come out here and compete every day. It's just it's all out. How much does Coach Mendoza's assistant and philosophies? Still some guys keep that I think so. Uh, I think this is everything he teaches us, like step by step. If you do it wrong or something, he'll make sure he says sometimes he's gonna be looking and he sees that you did it wrong just because he knows the defense so well. So I mean he'll pull you aside in the film room and tell you like how this how this is how you're supposed to do it and then fix the problem right there. Is that one of the strengths is identifying something really quickly like that and just being able to Related to you guys? Oh, yeah, he, he, he's definitely a good like, explainer and coach. So, I mean, like, even in game situations, like, we'll come in with a game plan, and sometimes they have to change it in the mid game just because what they're doing, like, they're, like, they're changing their offense too, so we always got to change something with our, with our defense. Did you get a chance to talk to Coach Khan, you know, when he was in the defensive analyst position? I talked to him a little bit, but you know, he can't coach it, so right. we, we never knew how he really was. But, He's a good coach. He's tough. I mean, of course, I mean, Grayson was a great high school, so I expected that coming from where he came from. So, I mean, it's just out there having fun. Yeah. But he, he really just likes to play for the most part. So, and he loves it when we got to compete in the offense. So, yeah. Was Ryan able to tell you a little bit about him? No, nah, he, he kept it a secret. He really didn't tell me too much about it. <laughs> when Coach Conn had his first meeting with you, kind of what was his message to you? Um, he just told me to have fun, be yourself. That's all he really said. And he, he's a big stickler on like going to play and all that. So it's just little details. How do you feel that your play was last year? Some things you did good at, some things you can improve on <coughs> next year. Just give us a little bit of specifics. I think last year I was more of like an inside box player, more of like a linebacker coming down here and making tackles. This year I got my freedom back to range around, play a little bit in the middle of the field. So I think I'll be more. I got to expose my game more just by showing my range because I'm a smaller safety. So in the league, not going to see a smaller safety come down in the box tackling. So I think just having my range back will help me out a lot. Have you switched positions? Yeah, I, I, I play. I played with Jadar. I played last year. So yeah, that's that's a strong safety. But ours is like really fit. So it's like the free safety. That's where, I, that's where I'm at now. Who's playing behind you? Uh, right now, it's out of Denzel and uh, <laughs> no one. No one turn. So, I mean, they're better than that. I got a battle too, but they're coming for me too. So. And behind What's Tanner? Uh, I wanted, I think it's Kareem Wiggins and Isaiah Simmons right now. So. Was that kind of the plan of progression to let you flip once Jadar left, or was that something you, you came up with, the coaches? How did that come about? I see when I first came in, I was behind uh, J. Ron Curtis and Jadar. So I started there first, 
And then once they seen I could play a little bit, they moved me to the free behind TJ Green. So then this year they just changed me back because I already know it. So they didn't want somebody else to come in there. We learn it. I already know it, so they just moved me back over.